Hi everyone, my name is Echo and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be doing a book subscription box unboxing from Beacon Book Box. I will put more information in the description down below, so if you'd like to know more, you should check there. I am really excited about this because I got this box and it was like stuck to the brim, so I'm really excited to see what's inside. So without further ado, let's go! Hi everyone, Echo from the future here. Full disclaimer, I've only just recently started getting back into reading books, so unfortunately there is a lot of books and fandoms that I'm not super familiar with yet. I do have them on my 2BR or TBR pile, so I will be reading them in the future, but please forgive past Echo for not understanding any of the references that she's gotten in these boxes. Anyways, back to our scheduled programming. Okay, so the box is open. The first thing I see is their cheat sheet card. So this month's theme was Scorched by Magic. I'm not going to look at this because I'd like to be surprised about what's in there. So, first thing I see is something. A fanny pack. Okay. Not going to lie, I don't know what's magical about this. Um, I'm assuming it's maybe someone they've just kind of collabed with. You know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look at the cheat sheet. Maybe, maybe it is something from a book and I just don't know about it. Um, blah, 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 blah. Nope, they don't even have anything in here about that, so maybe they just threw it in. Okay, well, I've got a fanny pack, so there we go. <laughs> uh, next thing I will pull out is a mystery box. I like mystery boxes. It's probably a mug. That's usually kind of what these size boxes come with. So. Ah. Yep, sure enough, it is a mug. Okay, and ooh. Okay, um, I don't know what this is a reference to, so I lied. I will be looking at the, the cheat sheet again. Um, for those of you who do know what it's from, which I will mention, like the design on it is, is really, really pretty. So let's see. Hunting Prince Dracula collectible enamel mug, two out of four. Okay, so looks like they have kind of a series with these mugs because I only just started getting this. I only got the series two, but it's still a really, really pretty mug and I never have enough mugs. So this will sure get use out of it. Okay, so they put the book in the top, but <gasps> it is very, very gorgeous. So this is Fire with Fire by Destiny Soria. And I am excited to get into this. It the description on the website for this month kind of really hooked me, so. Let's read what's inside there. It says, Danny and Eden Rivera were born to kill dragons, but that's the only thing the sisters have in common. For Danny, dragon slaying takes a back seat to everyday high school life. For Eden, slaying is her life. Yet they both agree on one thing. Where dragons are concerned, it's kill or be killed. That is, until Danny actually meets a dragon and ends up forging a rare magical soul bond with him. As they grow closer, she begins to question everything she thought she knew. Suddenly, the only thing Eden and Danny always agreed on is the one thing that could tear their world apart. With Danny lost to the wrong side, Eden knows she'll have to risk everything to bring her sister back from the edge, even turning to the mysterious and alluring sorcerers for help. Now on opposite ends of an impending war, the sisters will do whatever it takes to save the other. But the two are playing with magic that is more dangerous than they can imagine. And there is another more powerful enemy waiting for them both in the shadows. That sounds really, really interesting. I'm really excited to get into this book. And as I said, the cover on it is just absolutely gorgeous. So keep an eye out on my channel for this book review that I will be doing down the road. I'm really, really excited. Okay, so um, last thing in the box. That doesn't make any sense. Let's cheat. cheat. Okay, no, it does mention there is more. Okay, ah, okay. I thought this box was just empty, but no, there, there is there is more things in there. Um, but there was something on top. There was a pencil um, thing. So it says, there is always something new to discover every day, no matter how skilled you are. Again, I will go to the cheat sheet because I don't know what this is from. Okay, um, the Bone Witch inspired pencil pouch. So those of you who are a fan, the design on it, again, 
really really pretty i love the purple the quote is a nice quote even if i don't understand it that's nice okay so this is the item as i said here i thought the book was empty so i kind of already know what it is because i just looked at the cheat sheet this will be one of their picture frames that they've recently come up with oh yeah there's more stuff in there <gasps> Okay, first off, get it off the bubble wrap. This looks really, really nice. Ooh, this is a glass picture frame. And it's got another quote that I don't know. I know that for every dawn, dusk must unravel its darkness. But look at that. Ooh, you get to see my light there. I'll try to kind of keep it out. <laughs> but it's, that's a really, really nice frame. I will definitely, I have that Alice in Wonderland artwork and some other artwork that would look gorgeous in this. So I'm excited to use this. This will be really nice. <clears throat> okay, and it looks like we've got some little marks and things in here. We have an art piece. Oh, before I do that, huh, I should tell you what that picture frame's from because some of you may not know. Um, Spin the Dawn glass picture frame, collectible six out of six. So I think that's the last photo frame for that section but it was really really nice okay well keeping with this cheat sheet here because I apparently don't know anything in this box we've got Maya print collectible six out of six so very nice it's very pretty art print maybe oh maybe this is meant to go in the frame that makes sense it's about the same size so there you go maybe that's that's who's meant to go in there still very nice um, it looks like we have a code to get some free ebooks in Restless Dreams and I Walk Alone by Ren Hanman. There we go. We'll never say no to more books in ebooks. Okay, uh, we have the. Oh, it is a recipe card. So this, I'm assuming, is from the book that came with the pencil box. It says Tea's Chocolate Ice Cream. Ooh, I've never made ice cream before. This could be interesting. So there we go. So we've got a recipe card. Very nice. Oh, and we've got a bookmark from the Young Elites. Be true to yourself. And on, I'll throw that there. On the other side, we've got, but true rulers are not born, we are made. From the Rose Society. There you go. This is interesting. This is this is different because this isn't a paper bookmark. Um, I don't know if you can really kind of tell in here, but it's it's like a very thin wood. So that's kind of nice. I like that. It's a really like the artwork on that is is absolutely stunning. That's really really nice. Okay, and it looks like here we have our last item, which I think may have fallen out of my book because yes, it looks like it is the author's card. So it says, Dear Beacon Book Box Readers, I'm delighted that Fire with Fire has made its way into your life. This is a book about snarky dragons, sexy sorcerers, and a family of slayers. There's magic and mayhem, best friends, and very bad decisions. But at its heart, this is a story about two sisters discovering who they want to be in this world and who they are to each other. I have a sister of my own, and though we never trained to slay dragons together, I still remember all the complex feelings that come with having a sibling. Love and annoyance and jealousy and pride, all jumbled up together. Even if you don't have a sibling of your own, I think these emotions are universally relatable. Whether you see yourself in Eden's perfectionism, anxiety, and iron will discipline, or in Danny's fun-loving devil-may-care attitude, or somewhere in between. I hope you'll find something familiar and compelling in these pages, and if you don't, I hope you'll at least enjoy the cool dragons, epic magic, and endless witty banter. Happy reading. Well, if I wasn't already excited for this book, I was based off of this card, so that was really, really nice. Okay, well, that is it for the box for this month. The stuff in there was pretty cool, even if I don't understand some of the references in there. Get a lot, not gonna lie, a little bit disappointed. It seems like there was kind of less things in there based on some other book boxes I've seen, but I do have another one coming from them for July. Um, called Everything Faye, so, you know, I'll give them another chance and see how that goes. But thanks again for coming to my channel and watching my book unboxing. We'll see you all next time. Bye!